I've always believed in keeping yourself open to opportunity. I figure I've only got about 30,000 days on this planet and I've already used 8,126. Responding. I love your designs and want to know if you would do an original for me. I, I would be honored. I have a publicity stunt planned for my new movie at this year's Cannes Film Festival, and I think one of your designs would be perfect. Great. Uh, I'd have to see if you're fitting. When suits you? I was thinking 10 this morning. I don't know if I'd be able to get all my stuff packed up in there in time. Where are you located? Redondo Beach. Perfect. Text me the address and I'll see you around 10. Okay. Great. Bye. What? So you know how I DM my work to everyone? Yeah, did Beyonce get back to you? No. Angie Summers. Oh, come on. She's coming here right now. From a DM? I just got off the phone with her. You're not kidding. <laughs> I've got to get ready. Wait, the wild winter, Angie Summers? Yes. Do I smell? I don't think I have time for a show. No, you're good, but I have work. Do I call in sick? I don't think I can have all my friends here, dude. But I am all your friends. And like, you could say I'm your roommate. How about you come by after work? But what if she's gone? I'll take you to the fitting. You promise? I promise. Okay. from home. Is that a problem? No, I just didn't give you much time before I came over. Oh, it's no problem. Mm. Can I get you anything to eat or drink? Do you have a Red Bull? Uh, no, but I can get my assistant to get you something. <laughs> That'd be great. Oh, Orange Edition. I've been up all night. Okay. And if she's picking it up, maybe some raw broccoli? And a, and a large Voss water. Okay. Oh, and some mango. <laughs> that would be great. Anything else? Some organic strawberries. And that Orbit sugar-free gum, if she can find it. That's all. <laughs> all right, well, um, take a seat, and we can have a chat about what you're looking for. Polka dots? Eh. <laughs> Sorry. I really like this one. Perfect. You said this was for a stunt. Do you need something with, you know, a bit more coverage? Oh, no. It's not an action stunt. Um, 
Do you mind if I sit down? Yeah, go for it. When I'm at a festival, the press follows me everywhere. And after last night, it's gonna be crazy. Uh, so here's the publicity stunt. I'm gonna arrive on a yacht, and then I'm gonna take a walk down the dock, and then a stroll on the beach in a bathing suit. My new film's all about summer romance in the Hamptons, so I spend a lot of time in a bikini. I hated the wardrobe designer on this film. Why? We all have parts of our bodies that need a little extra care. And this bitch, I'm sure at the studio's direction, made every piece of wardrobe as small and up my ass as she possibly could. No flattering? Awful. So, when they asked me if I would do this, I said that I would, but only if I could choose the designer. An hour later, you message me. Serendipity. But, uh, won't she be mad? These pictures will be seen everywhere. And when she realizes it's not her designs, I hope her head explodes. I feel kind of bad. Not that bad. Let's make her head explode. <laughs> I need to measure you. Her. You smell great. What is that? Dior Bois de Jean. I love it. Where are you from? I'm from here. But I went to school in New Zealand since I was five. Oh, boarding school? Yeah, my parents kind of had this midlife crisis at 30, so I spent most of my childhood in a boarding school. Did you see them much? Sometimes. I mean, I figured it out pretty quickly. If I got in trouble enough, you know, they'd have to come visit me. <laughs> Tell the headmistress not to kick me out. <laughs> well, that should be it. Uh, I could have the draft by today. Amazing. So um, let's meet up later and I can make some adjustments. Oh, um, I actually cleared my whole day for this. So if you don't mind, maybe I could just take a nap on your couch? Yeah, sure, go for it. I asleep? Like two hours. I didn't sleep much last night. Do you want to try them on? Awesome. Oh, you can um try them on in the bathroom if you'd like. Oh, I'm so used to changing in like so many weird places that I don't even think about it, but okay, <laughs> I'll be right out. Are you starting some fucked up diet? It's not for me. I have a client. 
I bought some extra veggie stuff today. I promise you cream veggie food. Today's the day. Hi. Angie Summers. Hmm. Angie Summers is standing in your living room. It's my client, Lynn. I'm Lynn, Stacy's executive assistant, and I'm here for whatever you might need. Nice to meet you. Holy crap, you look so much better in person. And wow, you smell wonderful. Thank you. Holy crap, your bod. That's a movie star bod. Her body in your bikini is a perfect match. Okay, Lynn. Can you go get Angie a drink? Yes, I can. What would you like? Oh, did you get that Red Bull? One Red Bull orange edition in a glass? The can's fine. One Red Bull in the glass coming up. Oh, in the can. All right, right. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. What do you think? I really like it, but I don't think it's quite right. Do you think maybe we could look at the designs again? Absolutely. Yeah, maybe this one. Do you think you could do this fabric with a bandeau top? Absolutely. Do you have time to wait? This is my mission today. Then it's mine too. You need to be cool. I saw you smell her and you can't talk about her body. You should have told me that she was here. You can't surprise me with shit like that. No one can know she's here. No pictures, no social media. Oh shit, she's coming. What are you cooking? A Korean veggie lunch. Are you a vegetarian? I try, but not 100%. <laughs> not me. I love meat. All meat. Raw, cooked. I've eaten gator, rabbit, duck, snake, emu, goat, boar, bison, ostrich, quail, and guinea fowl. Wow. It was a gator chili. Might not even have been real gator. Impressive. You know what I want to try? Huh. Stuffed pigeon. Ew. Lynn? Stacy's a plant lover. Sorry. Can I help? Help me cook? Yeah, sure. I mean, what do you need me to do? Can you chop those? Mm hmm? I'm cooking with Angie. That would be a great TV show. You go to different places and cook with people. I'm not much of a cook. <laughs> Even better, Angie and Lynn's cooking show. The crazy Korean and the actress cooking all around the world. Lynn, next subject. Okay. Talk about <laughs> That was really good. Thanks. So your life must be like so a new adventure every day. <laughs> there are a lot of amazing days, but there are also a lot of days that I spend alone on location in my trailer. What's it like having sex with Ben Jacobs? Lynn. <laughs> It's okay. <laughs> Sorry, she has no filter. I'm going to tell you guys something that nobody else knows. And I have to trust that you won't tell anyone. Sure. I'm a vault. I've never had sex with Ben. You're gay. I knew it. No. Ben's gay? <laughs> Ben's gay? 
Holy crap. Ben Jacobs is gay? But you two are married. We are for now. Our publicist wants us to extend the breakup. You're fucking with us. Search my name. So this was all bullshit. Yep. <laughs> ben Jacobs and Angie Summers have called it quits. After two years of marriage, a spokesperson for the couple says it's over. It was all fake. Have you seen him naked? When? It was a business arrangement. His career was tanking and I was new and needed press. What could go wrong? So who else knows about this? Besides Ben and I? Three people and now five, including you two. Not even your parents? Nope. Yeah. <laughs> Surprise. I'm leaving, Jake. You just got here. No. I'm leaving LA. Why? Mostly because of you. Sorry, uh... No. Thank you. You made me feel normal. Like I had some self-worth. And I haven't felt that in a long time. See ya, Jake. Epic. I've never seen it. Shut up. I don't watch my movies. It's weird. What are you doing next? I have three projects coming up, but nothing that great. Want some gum? Sure. It's Orbit Sugar Free Gum. Nice. Mm -hmm. All right, number two, done and ready. I need a pen. Oh. I need to get more pens. <laughs> okay. Your butt is a piece of art. The best butt I have ever seen. <laughs> May I? Turn on, okay. Perfection. I'm gonna go burn this moment into my brain. Thank you. <laughs> I feel like it needs something on the top. You're gonna hate me. I love this one too, but do you think maybe we could go in a completely different direction? I mean, sure. You're just gonna be here all night. That's fine. <laughs> oh, money. We never talked money. No, I wanna buy all three, plus the design fee. It's all a part of the process. No, the studio's paying for it. Well, in that case, great. <laughs> Let's do it. Hey, how far is it to the beach? Uh, it's about a half mile. Let's take a break. Go see the sunset. We could get some wine. Okay. That sounds awesome. You know, it's been really nice to just get away from Hollywood for a while. Did you know the guy that invented the Pringles can was cremated and buried in one? Shut up. 100%. Another little known fact, obsessive nose picking called rhino to lexomania. <laughs> How do you know her? Lynn? Yeah. <laughs> well, 
I said I would work for free and I wouldn't leave until she said yes. Pretty much. Well, I hate to break up this party, but I have a date tonight. Ooh, nice. nice. I met him at the grocery store this morning. He saw me buying a bunch of weird stuff and then he started talking to me. And what does he do? Hopefully me, because he was looking fine. <laughs> if you need a personal assistant, let me know. Bitch, you have a job. <laughs> Gotta put out the feelers. Well, it was really nice meeting you. You know, thanks for letting me hang out and just finally get to be. It's okay. I think you should find what makes you happy, you know? And just do that. You're right. I'm going to. Wow. It looks amazing. It does, right? It looks great on you. I almost want to just say that I need to change something so I don't have to go. But it's great. And I need to go face the music. You had a really great time today. Thank you. And thanks for giving me so much to think about. So what now? I guess it's back to my soon-to-be fake ex-husband. Back to all the paparazzi. Well, you always have a hideaway here if you ever need it. Thanks. If you ever need anything. Thanks. <laughs> Just a best friend, Deb. Dropping by unannounced. Where is she? You just missed her. Is she coming back? I don't know. Dude, fill me in. She's gonna wear my designs at the Cannes Film Festival next month. It's the break that I've been waiting for. That's amazing. Why aren't you more happy? It's been a strange day. Weird, huh? You're weird, honey. Come on, wine time. What's up? Hey, I just sent you a link. Call me back, yeah? Say goodbye to Hollywood. Just hours after a sudden split from Ben Jacobs, actress Angie Summers is splitting back to her home state of Idaho. A statement from her publicist left more questions than answers. Publicist Sophia Gerardo stated, Angie has decided to stop acting for a few years to find what truly makes her happy. No one knows what happened in the last 24 hours, but one thing's for sure, we won't be seeing Angie Summers this summer. Sometimes it feels like one step forward and two steps back. But one day, I'll get the wind in my back and everything will fall right into place. Sometimes.